she um, sent out an email just letting people know that the products were for sale in Greenburn and they could also be <coughs> shop online and um, have a look at what was there as well. Um, that's just some of the stats from uh, Maya Chimp for the newsletter. Um, 98 opens out of 494. Um, it's not bad. Um, it was kind of, that's kind of the figure that they were getting for a lot of their stuff, but she's going to have to try and be a bit more engaging and a bit more um, exciting with her subject line and just try and wrap up the numbers as well in recipients. Um, going forward, there's loads to do. Um, we need to review and use the analytics data and try and get some benefit from that. Um, use some Facebook and maybe some Google Ads as well to try and get more targeted brides and um, people that are interested in those kind of vintage scene to her website. Um, traditional media then continue advertising at the wedding shows, um, speaking with brides, interacting with brides, getting their contact details, and then maybe being able to get in touch with them afterwards through um, email. Um, she goes to craft shows where she sells the products directly, again cutting out the retailers and maximizing her profit. Um, photographers, a lot of wedding photographers will take extra pictures for her, but um, it's very hard for her sometimes to try and get in touch with them afterwards and get the photographs from them. So she needs to um, react, she, she needs to speak to them a little bit more and make sure she's getting the pictures. Um, the shop needs to be kept up to date at all times, especially when the products are also selling elsewhere. She can't sell something that she doesn't have. And she's not using Twitter or anything else, so um, we need to look at get, getting her up and going with all that. <coughs> 